everyone, I'm Sharon Backman for CNET.com, hanging out at CNET Gotham in the CNET living room with the Roku XS box. This box gets you streaming content from the internet to your television, and today I'm going to show you how you can control it with your iPhone instead of the Roku remote so you can get rid of an extra remote in your living room. So the first thing you need to do is connect your Roku box to your home Wi-Fi network. Then connect your iPhone to that same Wi-Fi network. Now that you've got that set up, head to the App Store and download the Roku Remote app for a dollar. Once you download Roku Remote, open the app and head to the app settings. You'll see your Roku box listed. Tap it and your iPhone is now connected to your Roku box. Now that you have the Roku Remote set up on your iPhone, you can start browsing through channels, playing videos, and use the best feature, which is the on-screen keyboard. So instead of selecting through letters through your Roku remote, you can actually type naturally with your iPhone keyboard. So sit back, relax, and start using your iPhone as your Roku remote. For CNET.com, I'm Sharon Backman at CNET Gotham.